Have you ever wondered how accurate your memory truly is? Can it be influenced or altered by external factors? You might be surprised to learn that our memory isn't a perfect record of our experiences. It's not like a video recorder capturing each moment in crystal clear detail. Instead, our memory is a complex reconstructive process, constantly being shaped and reshaped by the information we encounter after the event. Imagine, for instance, you witness a car crash. Your memory of the event can be significantly influenced by how someone else describes it to you afterwards. This fascinating interplay between memory and perception was at the heart of a landmark psychological study conducted by Elizabeth Loftus and John Palmer. Known as the Loftus and Palmer Car Crash Study, this experiment demonstrated how easily our memories can be manipulated, throwing into question the reliability of eyewitness testimony. So the question arises, can our perception of an event alter our memory of it? The Loftus and Palmer study set out to answer just this. Imagine this, you're asked to watch a video of a car crash and then answer questions about what you saw. Simple, right? Now let's delve into an experiment conducted by psychologists Elizabeth Loftus and John Palmer. They asked participants to watch videos of car accidents. After viewing the footage, participants were asked to estimate the car's speed. Here's the twist. The question was phrased differently for each group, using various verbs like contacted, hit, bumped, collided, or smashed. Now you'd think that the verb used wouldn't make much of a difference, right? But here's the catch. The choice of verbs significantly influenced the participants' estimates of speed. Those exposed to the verb smashed reported higher speed estimates compared to those who were asked how fast the cars contacted. Intriguing, isn't it? The mere change in the description of an event can influence how we remember it. So, what does this mean for our understanding of memory and perception? Well, the implications of Loftus and Palmer's car crash study are far-reaching. It shines a light on the fascinating and somewhat unsettling reality that our memories, which we often consider to be reliable records of our past, are not always as accurate as we might believe. Our memories can be easily swayed by external information, subtly morphing over time. This study emphasizes how the power of suggestion can reshape our recollections, and this is particularly significant in legal settings. Imagine the weight of an eyewitness testimony in a courtroom. The reliability of such testimonies could be called into question if our memories can be so easily influenced. This doesn't mean that all our memories are inaccurate, but it certainly means we should approach them with a healthy degree of skepticism. So next time you recall a memory, remember, it might not be as accurate as you think.